Happy Easter everybody, hopefully you all are having a very good weekend. It's Rocco here, back with another Bitcoin and crypto video. I'll be sharing with you my thoughts on Bitcoin. Bitcoin is holding that 40k, short term I'm expecting a move up towards 43, 44, even 46k. Then I do expect another move down towards the 30k and that's going to be the you know do or die level. Are we going to hold 30k again and start trend changing higher? Are we going to start breaking 30k like we did with 6k so make sure you watch the video as usual guys this this channel i don't just share with you price going up or down i'll sh share with you exact trades when i'm buying when i'm selling i'll give you exact trade setups that we're looking at also if you want me to review any altcoins comment below now in the previous video i had quite a few comments but i'll review these coins i'll pick the top five top six coins altcoins so comment below any other altcoins you want me to review and final thing before i get started in the video i'm going live again about six hours from now, 7 p.m. UK time. So if you want any altcoins reviews, you want to see my trading strategy, um, you know, ask me any questions about trading, crypto, make sure you join. The past few live streams have been really good, uh, especially the one before that I shared that, you know, sell now if, if it gets back below here and we got below that price level and we had a huge sell off. So if you've been watching our channel, hopefully you sold some and have some tether to buy the Bitcoin dip and accumulate more and more Bitcoin. This channel, my goal is to keep you guys on the right side of the market. So hopefully, again, I'll get things wrong, but hopefully like the previous trades, I can keep you guys on the right side of the market then when we do get those crazy boom moves that we see in 2017 2020 2021 that's when you can make your life changing money achieve your financial freedom through crypto so let's get started with the video guys bitcoin is holding 40k and this is a really important support level once we broke above that 40k level we had a nice rally here and this is when everyone else get, started getting bullish and in cryptocurrency especially on youtube most technical analysis trade they're not traders they're just they're influencers they they can draw some lines and support levels but they don't know how to trade they have some crazy indicator that doesn't mean anything they started got getting bullish here and once we could not hold above here that is really bearish the trading strategy that i personally use it's about understanding what other traders are thinking it's about using psychology and demand and supply that's what moves price we can use indicators trend lines moving averages and whatever else you want to use by the end of the day it's about demand and supply Supply. once we got back above 40k got back above my moving average that's when i was bullish i thought more and more buyers will come in and that's a live trade we shared back in end of march you can go check this uh, uh, live trade out that's when we got bullish not up here i actually did buy bitcoin if you guys remember that was another trade we took uh, this wasn't on the live stream this was in the rockstar trading group so if you are interested in the rockstar trading group i'll leave the links below our live stream three to four times a week post my trades there's still coins that are going up and we've short some coins as well to make money from this dip so if you are t interested in taking your trade to the next level you can check us out guys but if not guys just hit that like button i really appreciate you guys just watching like and supporting the channel we did buy here but once we could not do this and we broke down that's when i got bearish this was really bearish because this is like a fake out this is what this is a pattern that we see happen a lot whales try to move the price up get newbies excited and use your liquidity they'll use your liquidity as exit liquidity move the price down get you stopped out and that's when we see the big move up so that's what's been happening with Bitcoin. What I expect now for Bitcoin is to hold 40k, which it is holding now. And then we see a nice little push up. In my opinion, guys, I do think that Bitcoin will rally in the short term. I don't really have a set, clean setup uh, for Bitcoin. The key zone I'm looking at this high, the high that we saw uh, this morning uh, in, sorry, uh, yesterday in Bitcoin. Also the highs we saw couple of days ago this was found support as well i see if we can break above here we should see a rally up into the 42 44k level and that is the trade i'll be looking out for again on the live stream hopefully if bitcoin breaks out in the live stream we're going to see that move during the live stream and maybe i can do live trading again like my previous few live streams i'm very picky most youtube traders buy sell every day i'm cautious you know when in 2020 2021 bull market i if you watch some of my live streams back then i just said buy anything with a wide stop loss my famous phrase buy some with a wide stop loss but in, in this time it's not the time to be aggressive this is the time to be you know protecting your wealth make sure you maybe use this time to learn about DeFi strategies i've got some lunar DeFi strategies on my channel i'll be creating more farming and DeFi content that's an amazing way to make money or you know learn about trading strategies learn to trade a market bitcoin forex or whatever you use this time or even spend time with your family and i've been a bit quiet past few days because bitcoin is not doing much 
Going forward, I think that today and tomorrow will be quiet in Bitcoin. And the main reason is this Easter holidays, the stock market is closed and a lot of the big players are not really trading in this market. There might be some liquidity spike moves. We've seen this. There's not much volume. So some bad whales, bad players in the market. They might move the market. But in my opinion, the plan that I shared in the Rockstar Trading Group before this weekend was I expect Bitcoin to chop around these two zones. I think Bitcoin will chop around here and then we'll see a big breakout on Tuesday. And the question is, what type of breakout are we going to see on Tuesday? Are we going to break down? If we can't hold above 40k, start breaking these lows, I think Bitcoin heads to the last support level here. On the shorter time frame, guys, I think 30k is a huge level last support level here and you know i've not really bought bitcoin since that break i'm gonna look to buy bitcoin here yeah, see if, if it sets up if not 30k is the level i'm buying so we'll have to see if bitcoin can hold above here if it does break the short-term bullish setup that i'm thinking which i think will rally into 44k might not happen and we see that big dip i do think we're going to see a dip and an, uh, an important analysis i want to share with you guys is again not many people are looking at this and again they look at chart patterns and indicators that don't mean much i use indicator but i use them as a trigger once i've got a bullish bias so if i want to show you an example and um once we've got trend changing above you can use your indicator trending up you buy here and that was the live trade setup from from the and i, and I keep going back to the live trade setup because i can sh share with you yeah i sold here i bought here but there's no not live proof there's no proof in the live stream i said it live and there's hundreds of people watching you can go back watch it again and it just shows you that you know how trading actually works there's lots of scammers here and like i said in this channel i want to keep you guys on the right side of the market and show you what trading is really about and you know help the people that put the work in to achieve their financial goals and financial freedoms so uh, the key thing i want to talk about now and i'll go into this in the in the youtube live stream later on we saw huge liquidity uh, dumps we saw this dump we had a huge spike up in volume we had a huge spike up here we're not seeing any volumes so i expect bitcoin to like have a huge spike down sell-off and hopefully that sell-off happens and then bitcoin starts pumping above 30k and that is the source that not many people look at understanding volume and what the big players are trying to do and you know i use volume profile and lots of other cool stuff but just to keep it simple on, on this youtube video that is going to be a key indicator for me to say if 30k is going to hold or 30k is going to break and that is going to be a big level for us you know getting that correct if we can get this correct we can make a lot of money if it dumps 30k straight through i'll potentially lose money as well but that's trading you have to take risk and as long as your risk reward is higher the first thing i teach is risk management anyone can learn strategies and there's lots of strategies my strategy is quite simple but unless you know those know those money making risk management strategies you're not going to make money long term so that's what i'm looking at bitcoin long term short time frame guys um, I'm looking for Bitcoin to just chop around here and this could allow altcoins to pump. I'll share with you two altcoins and I'll go through, you know, your altcoins. I'm actually looking for a trade setup in Luna. If Luna starts breaking back above this level and th I posted this on Twitter as well. I've got an alert set. Luna is a coin that I trade live on Twitter. If Luna breaks above here, I'm going to look to take a trade in Luna. I'll be targeting 90. I'm not sure if we'll move just about to 100, but I think at 88, 90, this resistance level, uh, Luna will come into that. And that is the main long trade, trade setup I'm looking at. And the other coin that um, i really like is i mean astro if you guys know this is a lunar uh, exchange token and i'm really bullish on this coin and um, we had a trade above you can look to buy some in this now again this is a small cap coin so i don't want to talk too much about there's some small cap coins that we trade in the rocks are trading group but there's you know we can't really share all of that on on youtube but this is a, a one coin that i will share with you so if you, these are two coins i'll share with you on the live stream and there's one more i'll share with you on the live stream so make sure you subscribe to the channel turn on the notification button and i'll share with you another coin on the live stream so before i look at uh, finish off with bitcoin i'll go through some of the old coin requests from the group and i've picked these and apologies if i missed yours comment below now so in the live stream in the live stream i should be have more time to look at all your altcoins but make sure you comment below the plan for this youtube channel is again I, before i should just share with you what i wanted but i really want to change the content and make this channel more about yourself so you can achieve your financial goals and because there's so many youtube channels with bitcoin price predictions it's hard to you know differentiate and if you're watching my content the Again, the thank you messages and likes are really means a lot to me. The plan going forward is I'll do one live stream. I try to do a live stream a week. Um, and then I'll be making a couple of Bitcoin videos. I'll have read around it if I'm bearish. And I, I talked about this video. Go watch this video. If sell below this. This was eight days ago once we broke here. You can check that. Um, I'll, I'll make these YouTube videos, Bitcoin videos during the week. And I'll review a couple of altcoins during the week. So maybe two, three Bitcoin videos during the week, especially if it's busy. And then I'll make an educational video as well. So I made one um, a couple of days ago. You can watch this. This is an overall strategy video. And I'll make another one whilst the market is quiet. Maybe tomorrow or Tuesday. 
that another strategy video will come out so one live stream a week two three bitcoin videos during the week and then a strategy video that will help you understand how we trade so let me know if you like that structure comment below like the video if you do like it and hopefully like i said bitcoin we can make money or protect our wealth now next rally that's when we really grab the bulls by the horn and take money out of this market so yeah i expect bitcoin to chop around here and especially with the international you know the holiday seasons there's not many big traders we can see the volume going down and down forex markets everything closed so i do expect monday uh, today and monday to be quiet and tuesday we'll see a break whilst the market is quiet altcoin traders don't care altcoin traders are always trading and i expect an altcoin move and we'll be looking at some altcoins in the live stream so let's go through some of your coin requests so knc i really like knc um i think knc is a buy um if we see a green candle now again this is a weekend market i don't really like this we took a long trade setup here on the pullback um i missed this buy i shared this live uh, on the live last live stream i shared this setup i didn't buy knc myself this would have been my buy uh, for now i'm not too sure about knc i think you can look to buy knc as long as we're above 350 for me to buy now if we see a green candle close above 460 i'll look for a buy towards all-time high breakout the only reason what's stopping me from buying KNC now is that BTC is not looking as strong. If BTC looked stronger, I would have been buying. And I'm really unfortunate that I've not bought bit, um, KNC earlier. This was my setup. But there's so many coins breaking out. You saw me buying Rune, uh, Luna. You know, Luna doubled in price. Some of the small cap coins pumped. Nia is still my favorite coin. And you know, I'm still long Nia. And all those coins pumping. So I've not uh, traded KNC myself. But if KNC, you know, this is a trade setup. If it can uh, get back above here, 460, you can look to buy. Stop below there and see if we can rally up to $5. We already came into our targets. If you did take the trade, uh, it went up about 15%. So wait for another big green candle to buy. So that would be my thoughts on KNC long term. I like it. Zilliqa, I actually don't like it. Um, I shared a short setup in Zilliqa. I don't know if it's uh, worked out. Yeah, it did. This is a short setup I shared when we pumped into here. And now it's you could look to buy as long as we're holding above 10 cent. But, you know, this type of move that are news related usually gives back. Um, so I wouldn't really be rushing to buy Zilliqa at the moment. And especially if it breaks 10 cent, if you're holding, do take some profit. Uh, my friend who bought Zilliqa... Um, you came onto the live stream last live stream uh, last Sunday. I told you to sell Zilliqa around here. Did you sell Zilliqa or are you still holding? Uh, comment below if you're from the live stream and you're watching this video. And um, yeah, at the moment, I'm not too big a fan of Zilliqa. I'm not look it's not the coin that I'm looking to buy. XRP, again, XRP. <laughs> I've got a love-hate relationship with XRP. I'm actually bearish XRP at the moment. Um, my plan is very simple in XRP. Uh, it's not a coin that I love like some other people. My plan is above $1 buy, below $1 sell. And if you draw a line, uh, 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 this is not my chart. I need to find my XRP chart. So yeah, uh, above $1 buy, below $1 sell is a plan that's worked quite well for us. We brought it here. We had a nice rally, almost doubled in price. We bought it here as well. We made some money and we sold below $1 and it's dumping now. I, I'm not sure if it will pump back above one dollar. But if we break sixty cent, I think XRP would come even lower. And long term, a lot depends on with the lawsuit. If that doesn't have a favorable breakout, I think XRP will dump. And I'm not going to look to buy and hold all this. It's not a coin that I love. There's lots of other coins. Whilst XRP has been around one dollar, Luna's gone from five dollars to you know ten x, twenty x. So don't you know? Uh, I don't like. Oh, I, I want to be trading coins that are going up. So I'm not a big fan of this. And and to be fair, I think someone asked me about XRP in the group, and I've shared. This short setup might not i'm not i've not traded this there are a couple of uh, shorts that we have taken i'm not short xrp myself but this is not looking great and if xrp uh, can't get back above 80 cent i think it heads lower and that was the trade setup i shared when we were here this was in one of the this was actually in the telegram group that was the short setup i shared in in xrp so uh, there was a live update in the rock so trading group so xrp um i've talked about luna already uh, i like luna let's have a look at cake cake's been really bearish and this was one of our favorite coins in the rockstar trading group this is not really doing much guys and um yeah this short setup actually worked out in in cake cake is sold off again another short setup i shared i said if we see this i'm buying but for now i'm not and um, i was staking cake i loved cake um cake made i said i've made a joke in the rockstar trading group we got in cake around here and we were staking it for over 100 percent apy uh, on pancake swap but then once cake broke, we, I said I'll change the rocks to trading group name from actually you've seen one of my other him uh, and other small cap coins that we bullish in in the rocks to trading group. But yes, yeah, so we said if if this 
if cake pumps 100 i'll i'll change rocks to trading group to pancake swap because you can imagine the money we'd be making while staking getting the apy rewards and the price pumping but once we broke once we faked out here like bitcoin has this is when i exited staking cake and unfortunately it hasn't been that great and you can still use the strategies there's a pancake swap uh, video series strategy on my uh, like youtube we made it whilst we were in this zone you can still use it on other platforms you can use the same strategies on luna and they will still make you money you can go check that video out so pancake swap ada there's three more coins i'll do and then i'll round up um comment below guys i'll pick the top five altcoins and in the bitcoin videos i'll share with you one of the coins that we're trading like i've shared with you astro and then also share with you a couple of your coins that you pick cardano i don't like uh, below one dollar then th that, that this really works it sounds like a simple strategy but using round numbers works in crypto we bought one dollar so many times and it worked it 3x and then it's back here again for me above one dollar i'm happy to look to buy but ideally guys if we can break here 120 and charles hodgkinson is always pumping his coin this is, could be an inverse head and shoulder pattern breakout above 120 and i'd look to buy that for now i'm not interested i think this goes lower break above one dollar i will be i will be bullish mmf i've never heard of this coin um yeah wh whoever's asked for mmf join the live stream i can try and find the chart on um coin market cap or poo coin or somewhere else i can't find this here so finish off with pyr and again i'm massively bullish on pyr one of the best gaming tokens um this is not our chart this is we traded some live trades on pyr this bull move and then once we broke 15 that's when we're not bullish at the moment long term i'm massively bullish on pyr i think this is a gaming monster there's a really good youtube video on pyr which talks about pyr's fundamentals they're a gaming company first and crypto second and that's what i like about them i prefer companies that are gaming first and then not just crypto and then trying to jump on the gaming hype we got a 10x trade on pyr uh, for me i look to trade pyr again above 15 dollars for me i'm looking to buy here so we bought here we rallied bought here rallied i'm happy to buy here again around 10 dollars. i think this will potentially come here if it comes here i'll buy at least for a bounce but long-term trade needs to break above 15 break above 15 uh, i think we're going to rally in pyr and i'm pretty confident next book bitcoin rally or crypto rally pyr will potentially hit new all-time highs or at least come back to this level so keep this in your watch list this is a coin that we trade and i will always post updates about it that's all the altcoins guys if you want more of these altcoin videos you know live stream three to four times a week join our amazing community coins that we're trading and all that good stuff i'll leave the links below for you to check out i'm not sure how long i'll be doing this it takes a lot of my time and with the uh, you know, world opening up again i'll be traveling so join now if you want to learn our strategies and i'll leave the links below if you want to check out if not guys just hit the like button i really appreciate everyone that's watching and i really you know it's a great privilege that you guys listen to my youtube videos so if you do enjoy it hit that like button and support the channel and like i said next bull market let's actually make money someone said will you show your face if bitcoin pumps to 100k yes i will if we get an old coin i'm not the most confident guy there's lots of influencers that's why they get so many followers for me i'm more of a trader I, this is what i love doing but yeah if, if, if bitcoin pumps to 100k yes uh, maybe i'll do a face review so let's finish off with bitcoin um Bitcoin for me is chopping at the moment. I expect the chop to continue here. Uh, you can see volumes die now. I don't expect any moves in the next few days. Altcoins might rally and I'll, I'll talk about that in the live stream. There's a couple of altcoin trades to be had whilst Bitcoin is chopping. But I think Bitcoin chops and Tuesday is going to be the big day. And I'll probably make another YouTube video for you on Tuesday. And the live stream later on today for altcoin trading. And then hopefully we'll try and catch the next Bitcoin move on Tuesday. So thank you very much. Smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel. Check out the group if you're interested. Guide. If not, smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys soon with another great video. Thank you very much.